Buenos dias, bien benitas. Don't worry, it is still me and this is still the Cell Guru Show. If I'm speaking in a foreign language, I have to be in a foreign land. I am here, Barcelona, Mobile World Congress, and you obviously didn't know what I got out there. I'm going to rewind it. We'll start all over again, this time with subtitles. Buenos dias, bien benitas. Okay, so we've seen what that was. That mask, if you notice, was actually for a girl. We couldn't get a better one. That was the most beautiful one. And I said, that's okay. I am not insecure about my sexuality. So we went with a girl's mask. I'm here in Barcelona. As you can see, it's really cold. Can I confess something? It's actually not very cold. When we checked the weather and came here, this is what I thought I should wear. It's actually quite warm here. But then I got all these clothes. I just thought I'll wear it. We are here in Barcelona for the Mobile World Congress, the biggest mobile show event in the entire world. And our journey started from a very different place. Our journey started by driving away from Barcelona to rural Spain for a tour of the very fascinating Paris Balta. A tiny family-owned winery founded in the 1930s spread over 176 hectares, right next to the Mediterranean Sea. Straight from there we went to another awesome site, a site that gets burnt into your eyes forever. The Sagrada Familia is a large Roman Catholic church in Barcelona and has been called the most extraordinary building in the entire world by many architects. Designed by Anthony Gord, it is still incomplete and is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. And from there, straight to another temple, the Temple of Mobiles, the MWC. That then has been the journey till now, but now we're changing destination. I'm here at the crossroads of the big event, the Mobile World Congress. This is it. Look at the energy. Look at the people, analysts, bloggers, reviewers, people that have their devices out here. Everybody's here. It's early morning. It's about to start. And look at the energy. It's absolutely amazing. This is mobile phone territory of the insane, and you are about to be part of it. So ladies and gentlemen, every single person who right now was looking at your television screen, you are very, very lucky because you are one of the first people in the world who's been shot with a 41 megapixel camera phone. No, I haven't lost it. I'm not drunk. I even haven't had, even had a glass of wine till now. This is a 40, let me repeat it again, 41 megapixel. Of course you think I am joking. So let, let me get the camera close and watch. What does it say? 41 megapixel sensor. That has got to be the most unbelievable statistic I have seen here at the Mobile World Congress. 41 megapixel, you can actually shoot this. Here is a raw untouched, I'm holding it wrong. Raw untouched, look at the detailing. This is the kind of photography you can manage with a camera phone now. So for each one of you who said one day the camera phone will catch up, well, it already seems it has. Let's take a look at this unbelievable phone. Uh, I was pretty impressed with the lineup. I do think that they're moving in the right direction, that Nokia is moving in the right direction. And I think that the camera phone was very impressive. I was sort of surprised they didn't have something bigger and newer, but I do think that the PureView is a pretty amazing uh, camera phone. Um, well, that is like, it's a really impressive camera on a mobile phone. Um, I am particularly impressed by its ability to focus, specifically in a macro setting. It can focus on the one one object so it's really clear and behind you get a sense of the depth of field because that's blurry, like, like quite like a full DSLR. Pure view is an excellent technology. I think a lot of people will miss the fact, uh, just rave about the fact that it's 41 megapixels and miss the entire idea of pure view because pure, pure view is not about having such large megapixel sensor but what you do with it. Repeat after us, 41 megapixel. Yes, just roll that around your tongue. 
41. And just for good measure, say it again, 41 megapixel. That just blows everything else out of the water. The impossible has been achieved. What no DSLR can claim, this little phone can. The megapixel war has come to an end. No other phone made as much news as this one and it seemed that Nokia had managed to keep it a secret very well as nobody knew of it at all. PureView 808 is a simple Symbian phone but the image sensor is certified at 41 megapixel and significantly larger than the norm. You don't have to make use of the full scale of megapixels. There are loads of size options allowing you to snap at a more level-headed 5 or 8 megapixels. The PureView offers more manual control than any other phone. There is an amazing level of detail in the finished pictures. Zoom into a photo with the usual pinching gesture and keep pinching. Pictures are so detailed you can zoom into the smallest detail. Running on Symbian Bell, it comes with a 4-inch AMOLED display with a simple interface of rounded square icons. It has a 1.3 GHz processor with 512 MB of RAM and 16 GB of memory. You can expand that with a micro SD memory card for storing your massive 41 MP camera pictures. There is a front camera too. The video recording also goes a notch higher with 1080p. The phone is chunky but not oversized. Nokia has done a pretty good job of minimizing the bulge factor of the camera lens, which swells out smoothly from the top of the phone without unbalancing the design. Nokia did manage to put preposterously high megapixel count of 41 on its camera and you can print images as large as a building from this one. Watch out for an exclusive detailed review soon. Pure View is, is a new, like I mentioned, a new standard in uh, smartphone imaging. A 41 megapixel sensor technology, unheard of. Uh, our plan would be to demonstrate this with actual real use cases. So the fact that you can actually zoom in into a picture and actually see the level of detail that you can't see on a, another picture shot by a smartphone or actually another device in the market is a phenomenal uh, a marketing uh, experience that we will bring to the market. The NDTV news app had redefined the entire genre. Now, another market beater. It's already hit number one. NDTV Profit, India's number one finance app. Download free at ndtvprofit.com slash apps. Live stream of NDTV Profit, market news, and your easy to manage portfolio. Download now, ndtvprofit.com slash apps.